the priorities identified by this forum largely coincide with the current economic and fiscal challenges which the European Union, Brazil and the international community as a whole are confronted with. The main questions are how to overcome the deteriorating economic outlook, the debt crisis, the financial market volatility, to restore economic growth and create jobs. Since the second quarter of the year, the pace of world growth has been slowing. The global economic outlook has deteriorated in recent weeks. There also is the public debt crisis in the Eurozone. The slowing economic growth is not mainly due to fiscal consolidation. It rather has to do with rising inflation all over the world, credit restraint and a lack of confidence by consumers as well as investors. And it is also clear that deficit spending cannot be the answer to the current situation. We want to send a strong signal of global unity and to agree on a common response for short-term as well as for long-term measures. Avoiding a worldwide recession is the first priority, and this requires efforts from all sides. All main world players have to put their house household in order, and on top of this, we need more international coordination on trade and on exchange rates. Protectionism is a recipe for failure. We also need to find new drivers for growth. The development of a green economy offers many opportunities. Ecology and economy go hand in hand. Therefore, we think that the Rio Plus 20 conference in Rio de Janeiro next year is an important initiative. That's why we decided today with President Rousseff to deepen our environmental cooperation. Managing a monetary union with 17 democracies, with 17 governments and parliaments, either creditor or debtor nations, this has not been easy. You may be assured that we will do what is needed. It is in our own interests, of course, but also in yours. We will win this battle. We owe it to Europe. We owe it to the Europeans. Thank you.